My first question has to be for you, Roberto, which is where did the, I mean, we all grew up loving the Archie comics, but where did the idea of taking that legacy to the, what we see on the screen on the CW every week now? Yeah, I mean, I, I think really early on, uh, uh, is a lifelong passion for these characters, and and originally it started out as as a more traditional coming of age show, and when I uh, had uh, our first meeting with Greg Berlanti, who's the godfather of this, the godfather of comic book shows on TV, the godfather of coming of age shows on TV, the godfather <laughs> of he's not here, <laughs> but, but he'll be watching. Who's not? Uh, no, but, but right, very right. quickly, you know, we had the, we, the whole yeah, yeah. We, we had we had our meeting. We started talking about it, and he said, "I love this. I love these characters. Uh, I love the coming of age aspect, but I think you need a dead body." <laughs> and, and I thought, and I thought he was kidding. I was like, "Yeah, you, you metaphorically, what are you talking about?" He goes, "I think you literally need a dead body, <laughs> and I think you're going to want a, a hook and a genre element and and something that helps." Uh, the show cut through, cut through kind of the white noise that's out there. And I, I resisted at first. And maybe six months after that meeting, I said, Greg. Six months? Six months, you know, because we, we developed the that pitch. That was a dead body that was in formaldehyde. <laughs> exactly, exactly. And then I went back and I was like, Greg, I have a great idea. We need a dead body. And he was like, I think that's great. So it was, and then, but, but once we kind of landed on that, that element, the show crystallized creatively. It kind of became about the tension between the Archie characters, which are which were which had been wholesome or are usually more kind of idealized and 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 Riverdale's a utopia and these darker, more noir elements, that in that kind of tension is where the show thrived and where the characters came alive and where where I think all of us got creatively excited. Uh, uh, so so once we landed on that, it was kind of all systems go.